Ben, Jock said it was all about the focus, especially there in the first quarter. Describe how focused you guys are, just like the mindset going in. Um, very focused. I, I think that's one thing. And like when you play, you know, great teams like that, um, it's attention to detail. So you got to be focused all four quarters um, with the game plan defensively and offensively. And it seemed because the game went on, you, you got more and more aggressive going to the basket, especially like Giannis. What, was that the way the defense was treating you? Or just just, the I, game? That's something I'm trying to remind myself with. I think, you know, people forget, you know, I had back surgery. It's not something that's just automatically you're good and you're able to go out there and be yourself. Um, it's something that I'm trying to build and just keep adding up because, you know, come playoffs, I got to be there. The, you know, that engine to, to attack and find my guys. And then early on this win streak, you know, it was kind of like Groundhog Day when you guys would go off to a hot start, you know, yeah. leaves would go away, we'll be in the second, third, and it seems like in recent games, you know, you guys have kind of kept, when they yeah. punched back, that hasn't been an issue as much. What, what do you think has changed there? That's what it's going to take. You know, we can come out and, and have a great half, um, but it's going to be that second half, you know, that, that we got to, you know, stay focused in um, and, and be relentless and keep that same focus, um, you know, throughout that second half. When a guy like Rick is as hot as he is, how confident are you of, of him not missing the shot and trying to Clacks? Keep, yeah just trying to keep feeding him like that yeah Stay aggressive. You know, it's, it's, it's with anybody. You know, you see a hot hand, you know, keep giving the ball, um, and you want to see him, you know, staying aggressive. Ben, you know, obviously, Milwaukee's going to be a team you're going to go up against in the East to try to come out of this conference. Um, to get this win tonight, what does it do for you, for guys? It's, it's, kind of it's, a, it's a big win for us, you know. Um, next game to Cleveland, so. <laughs> We're used to numbers like eight assists from you, but to see have so many guys with multiple assists, yeah. what was it that was working so well like, to find the offensive flow? Just playing basketball. Um, I think, you know, when we get stops, it's easy to get out and run and get open shots. So um, for us, we got to be aware of that. You know, it starts on defense. And, uh, you know, you know when you got, see guys hitting shots, you want to pass the ball. It's, it's contagious. So that's a fun way to play basketball. That's how it's supposed to be played. I think everybody knew that you would be the primary defender on Giannis for a lot of tonight. And I think everybody knows that he's going to get his points at. Yeah. But what went into the way you defended him and were able to kind of keep him from getting to his spots? Um... I mean, you know, he's gonna, you know, he's gonna attack. He's gonna try and get to the rim. Um, I think overall, as a team, we did a great job um, containing him and, and kind of showing him a lot of bodies. Um, and then for me, just being physical, you know, uh, I'm able to get down there and hit with you. So, you know, I'm willing to do that. Jack said there was a point maybe a couple weeks ago where he showed everybody their individual box out percentage, and he said since then, like everybody's picked it up. Just hey, do you remember your box out percentage at that point? It wasn't. It wasn't great. It wasn't great. I'm not going to say what it was. It wasn't great. What's that feeling, though, when the coach kind of calls you out? On it's good. You know, I like to be called out, you know, especially when I'm not, you know, contributing to helping the team win. So, you know, for me, um, I want to be able to, you know, improve in certain areas to help this team. And what have you seen from TJ defensively? There's so many questions. <laughs> no, defensively, TJ, he's gotten better, you know. No, nah, he's been great. Um, I know he's looking at me over there, but he's been great. You know, just building his confidence. It's hard to come back, especially when he's been out of the game for two years. Um, so he, you see him building his confidence, hitting shots, um, boxing out. He was actually top of the list. He had the biggest difference in box outs. So he's, uh, he's been doing well. When a coach calls that out for everybody, the box out percentage, just what's the, what's the group's reaction to that? Did everybody just take it on themselves to improve that? Or? I mean, you have to. I mean, it's right in front of your eyes. It's not like a, it's not a made-up thing. It's a real stat. So um, you just got to be aware, you know, where we can get better. Um, and that's one of them. That's something everybody can do, box out.